It was an Ask ELE Anything session, and he didn't shy away from discussing the stingiest Jamaican artists. During an Instagram live with DJ slash producer Noah Powa and selector slash artist Tony Matterhorn, the Willie Bounce hitmaker candidly listed his top five most frugal peers. Matterhorn, first, he quipped. Ghost, second. I Octane, third, the stingiest Rasta. Ninja Kid's tight until he's chubby. You don't want me to name all five, Dex adapts. Later, Elephant Man remarked that Ninja Kid gives reluctantly, with Matterhorn adding that he's stingy kind since he tries to gain more while giving less. The tight up skirt artist Red Rat also received a mention. Red Rat's so tight we don't even know where he lives, ELE joked. Every man's driving home, and we're like, hey, Red Rat, you know I'm a DJ, we won't let you drive alone up to that hill. He says, no, I'm good, then sneaks off and turns off the car lights, not wanting anyone to see which house he turns into. Stingy Mun. Says, ELE, it's my house, do you want them to come beg me? These remarks raised questions about ELE's own generosity, but Matterhorn defended him, noting that the energy gad is no stranger to splurging on his friends. ELE added, I'm the only artist who takes Noah's friends, like Bounty Killer's friends from around him, every artist, takes them abroad with me. Me and them are close. I take every selector. I call Cartel and say, Cartel, come here, you need to give the selectors things. Bro, I run the show. I walk around with two knapsack bags of money. I remember taking every artist, me and Roundhead, to Gemini nightclub and saying, hey, I'm buying all the girls out, I want them to dance for us. Stingy? If I'm stingy, I'd take myself away and leave you in the dance hall. On a different note, they highlighted kind-hearted artists like Mavado, Sisla Kalanji, Capleton, Buju Banton, Spraga Benz, and Wayne Wonder. ELE described kindness as generosity, exemplified by Beanie Man, Beanie doesn't carry money, but he's generous, he explained. Me, Beanie, and Cartel were at the beach, and I said, everyone pays their bill. Beanie, do you have money? He says, lend me your phone, I'll call Blue. I said, you're calling your brother from your house to come pay for you right here? Beanie doesn't carry money. Beanie's the only artist who doesn't carry money or a phone. Then there are the self-sacrificing types, with ELE mentioning that, Ninja, man, is generous until he's poor. Viewers also questioned Dancehall's most successful artist, Sean Paul. ELE revealed that the Gimme D Lightstar isn't one to spend frivolously. Sean Paul has a van named Move Over, ELE disclosed. I saw it and said, Sean, this big, ugly green van. You know when you have a farm up in the hills and don't want a puncture? Sean Paul is one of the richest artists and has a van named Move Over. These guys aren't picky. Sean Paul says, ELE, I don't know why my mom doesn't want me to buy a big Benz and whatever. I said, so what did you buy? He said, ELE, see it, and when I looked, I saw a big, old dumper van. These guys have their savings locked.